Hello everybody, this is Joe from Mountains for Everybody's Sight and I am here in my Krua Duo Dome tent and I was using a sleeping pad from the same brand. Uh, this is the, uh, the compression bag that, that uh, I have with this bag. And uh, I want to say just a few words how this bag performed during the night. It is February. So the temperature was around 5-6 degrees in the tent and uh, I didn't feel really uh, comfortable so I added this thin liner and then this changed a lot uh, so really I was pleasant uh, uh, all the night. I was even thinking of removing a liner during the night because at, in some periods I felt uh, warm. Uh, so again, the temperature was around 5-6 degrees in the tent and uh, I had only a thin uh, thin fleece on me, maybe you can see it, it's dark in the tent, and one synthetic uh, polo with uh, short sleeves. And the pants are very thin synthetic but with uh, a liner uh, inside and, uh, well, thick socks and a beanie. And uh, it works great, uh, just to get some idea. Uh, all the features of this pad are described in my site, so you can check and then compare the, the temperature which they uh, claim for this uh, pad and uh, see uh, how it works uh, when compared to what I was telling you here. And then you can get some idea if it will work for you or not. So I'm now at home and uh, I would like to say a few words about uh, the temperature rating of this graphene sleeping bag. Uh, I have my post uh, review in front of me. Uh, this is my site, Mountains for Everybody. And uh, to show you the official uh, temperature rating for the, for the pad, it is uh, from what I have found on the, on the site of Grua Outdoors. They say the lowest temperature limit, 23 Fahrenheit or minus 5 uh, Celsius. Uh, so they don't give the comfort limit. And uh, if you check some other uh, sleeping bags, you will realize that this is usually 5, 6 degrees uh, above the, uh, lower, the lowest temperature limit. So for this sleeping bag, this, this would mean around 0 or 1 degree. Uh, Celsius. I have tested this sleeping bag back in the mountains as well. Uh, I was uh, using the, the, the bag in the Italian Alps last autumn and I have here in the, in the post uh, some pictures and uh, numbers about this. Uh, the temperature that I experienced in the mountains are normally similar to what I have experience uh, these days uh, in, the, in the forest here when I was testing the, the bag uh, because I sleep at high elevations. But I would say that uh, the comfort limit around zero uh, is probably too optimistic. I don't think that uh, this sleeping bag is uh, for such low temperatures. I wish to stress that in, uh, in, the, in the video here in the forest that I, uh, when I used the, the sleeping bag, the humidity was huge, uh, over 90%. And of course, this uh, contributes to the feeling of cold uh, more than when you are in a dry area. So I may be wrong, but uh, again, I didn't feel completely comfortable when I had the temperature in the tent around 5 degrees and uh, the humidity was in the range 80, 93, something like that. Uh, and that's why I added a liner. But of course, this is uh, this all all dependent on how much uh, uh, stuff you have on on you. I I wasn't uh, really uh, I didn't have especially warm and uh, thick layers when I was sleeping because I, I don't feel comfortable. But uh, well, let's say that uh, my conclusion would be that this sleeping bag is for temperatures above. 5 degrees Celsius, at least from my own experience. Well, thank you for watching.